Hey guys, Brad M73 here. Welcome back to Farmer's Dynasty. Um, wanted to address a couple of the questions that um, you guys have have given me over the last oh, couple days, I think. Um, the two main ones are a lot of people have said, well, Brad, you know, you, got, you still have not shown us um, all the equipment in all the shops. And I'm going to do that in this episode. Um, first, though, somebody asked me about starting the fire, and right outside the farm here, you just go past the hen house, follow the path down to the left, there's a little um, fire pit here, and you can walk up and hit E, and the fire will start. Now, I haven't actually tried to do this at nighttime, so I don't know, I, mean, I might actually try to speed, oh, look how pretty that is. Just look how pretty that is. I'm sorry, but... I, I haven't seen scenes that nice in Farming Simulator. <laughs> um, but yeah, I haven't tried this at night yet, so um, hopefully if I can um, kind of speed things along enough in this episode, maybe uh, maybe we'll get to see it, or maybe it'll be like the next episode or something. Uh, the Okay, so um, I am going to take the pickup truck, and we're just going to zoom out, look at the map as a whole, and oh the pickup trucks up here well that's that's all right we have three different shops there's one here on the right so i that's kind of like the vehicle store east there's one up here by the town so i'll call that vehicle store north and then there's one down here which i think we passed in the last video um which i'm going to call vehicle store west so we're going to start out with the uh, east store go to the north store and then we're going to go down to the west store so um, I'm just going to teleport here into the truck and we'll see you back at the, uh, at the store. So here we are at the east, easternmost vehicle store. Let's go ahead and uh, jump out here of our rusty pickup truck. Hopefully they'll put like a newer truck in the game that we can maybe eventually buy. Um, there's a lot of duplication here. Um, first we have the Linder uh, Geotrack uh, 134 EP, um, 144 brake horsepower, 144, I'm assuming that's a liter fuel tank and it's a CVT to transmission. So it costs 90,000 euros or 45,000 euros plus 90,000 social points. Uh, we have two bale trailers. They're both exactly the same. 11,000 euros or, you know, 5,500 with 11,000 social points. Um, and yeah, square bales. Doesn't say how many it carries. Uh, we also have the uh, Flegel DK18088. Uh, for 18,000 euros, has an 11,000 uh, kilogram capacity, which is much more. I think the, I think the trailer we currently have is only like 3,200 or something like, or 3,600. And then we have the Amazon Senius uh, 3002. Uh, this is a cultivator, and it also costs 13,000 or 6,500 with the addition of 13,000 social points. So, um, so that's it. If you go inside, actually, I don't know if you can go inside of this one. We'll walk up and see, and no, we can't. Some of them you can actually walk inside, but I guess this you cannot. And I don't. Are those like candy bars, or I don't know what all those things are. Uh, it looks like motor oils and things like that in the back and on these shelves some gift cards you know and just lots of oil and lubricants so um let's head on up to the uh the northernmost vehicle shop so we'll be right back with that Okay, so here we are watching the train go by, and this is the northernmost vehicle shop. Uh, and here we have, I think this is just like a generic combine. It kind of looks like a fence, but I'm not sure what it is. Um, why? Okay, here we go. It's just called a grain combine. Um, has a, a capacity of 12,000 kilograms, uh, which is oddly more than the trailer, but okay. 
uh, or I think it was, um, 110,000 euros or 55,000 euros plus a bunch of social points. And yeah, 150 horsepower, 980 liter fuel tank. Uh, we also have the corn header for it. 7,000 euros to buy or 3,500 with some social points. Uh, the grain header. 9,000 or 4,500 social points. Why is this saying, oh, it, it, wait, why is it saying brake horsepower of 100 and a fuel tank of 100 uh, and an automatic transmission? I uh, don't know what that's all about. Um, th here we have the larger, uh, the Lemming J17 plow, and I cannot wait to buy this. Uh, 28,000 or 14,000 euros and 28,000 social points. Uh, again, the Amazon... Senius 3002, um, same price as before. Uh, we also have a grass mower this time, the Boxer 275 for $2,500. Um, a few, well, I guess last month, they this thing was actually selling for like 40000 so glad they lowered the price. Um, currently the largest seeder in the game, the Amazon D9 4000 Super for 15000 which is pretty good with nice glossy uh, wheels there. But yeah, it looks really nice. I love how the metal, you know, actually looks like metal on here. Um, and then we also have the Zunhammer, uh 18 or 18,500 for 48,000. This is just a uh, manure spreader, liquid manure. Spread your diarrhea. Oh, and this, uh, this store we can actually go inside. Or maybe we could go inside the one... Uh, but it wasn't late enough in the day or something. I don't know. So, yeah, I don't know what those are. Candy bars, I guess. So, there's no people in here to, you know, wheel and deal with or order anything extra. Um, but last and not least, we're going to head on over to the uh, Western Vehicle Store. And so I'll see you back when we get there. Okay, so here we are at the last farm machinery shop, and uh, here we have the uh, the HDS pickup. This is basically uh, to pick up your um, building materials and you know put them on the trailer so you can haul them around with you. Um, currently, the the building material missions aren't in the game, but I think that's coming not in the next update, but in the one after. We have the Zunhammer again. We also have the Roush um, 7, is that a 70, 7010, I think. It says the Roush TWS 7000 costs 35,000 euros or 17.5 with the social points. Uh, holds 12,000 uh, kilograms of fertilizer. Let's see if I can get a nice, nice pan around here. It's very nice. Um, let's see, we once again have the Amazon uh, uh, Cultivator, the Flegel uh, Trailer, same one as before, the Mower, and then the the Linder Geotrack 134 EP again. So, again, prices are all the same. So there is that. Now that you guys know, uh, we can move on to other things. And I think I'm going to start off by talking with Lydia. And I, oh wait, maybe we'll do, we're going to stop by this, this house first. And then we'll go up and see Lydia. Because I want to, this, this might actually be a job where we have to do some repair work. And it would allow us to uh, get some extra money. So uh, let's time lapse. We're going to have a lot of time lapses in this episode. Because we got a lot of stuff to do. And. Um, not a lot of time, so uh, let's see here. Which way do I want to go up there? All right. So we'll see you back in just a second. Okay, you might have noticed I made a wrong turn up at the, up at the next building. Uh, we're going to come over here, and who do we have? We have Wyatt. Hello, oh, Wyatt. Sorry. 
Not now. What? Hi. Hello. Hmm. Mm, he's not impressed with me. I'm looking for work. Let's see what we got. Hopefully, it's work. some building. For me? A building on my farm needs some. Yes. Care. What do you think? I think it's a great idea. Sounds good. I'll take care of this. And hopefully, hopefully we'll be able to uh, maybe buy a cow or two this episode. Um, I've heard that you want to purchase cows as soon as possible. Um, that way they can be making um, manure because they basically just automatically produce manure every day. And uh, you want to basically max out your cows ASAP. Um, and I actually, on my test map, found that, yeah, manure is incredibly... Like, it, it goes super fast. Let's just put it that way. So we'll just repair this barn up and we'll get a little bit of money. It's not a lot. Um, usually for a repair like this, we'd get a lot more. So I don't know why. Or maybe it's just a roof repair, mainly. I don't know. There's quite a bit of wall work, I guess. But I'm just targeting the very outer lip of the... Um, wait, did we get it? I guess we did. The very outer lip of that roof so that we can, um, you know, reach it from the ground without having to put up a, a scaffold. Okay, anything? Why can't I go in here? It's odd. It's almost like a door is missing there or something. All right. So anything else in here? Nope. <clears throat> so basically the, just these two wall bits and we'll, we'll be done. I hope. Uh, oh, I must have fixed it. All done. All right. So stand back and be impressed with our handiwork. Um, too bad that we don't have more to do here, but oh well. Chloe and Layla. Hi, Chloe and Layla. Um, I've noticed that... Wait, where's Wyatt? Oh, there he is. I've noticed that more women in the game now have their hair, but still there's a lot of them that are missing. Your task. Okay, so we got 360 euro and 720 social points. So that's just enough to buy one cow and get some social points. Uh, so now we have to drive, um, let's see. This guy almost certainly, okay, he's got the manure spreader. I think he makes us plow one of the fields, but I'm not, I can't remember. So um, let's go ahead and uh, check that out. I'm not, I'm not certain that I really want to do the uh, plowing mission, if it is a plowing mission right now. I think that it is, but I'm not positive. And the only reason I don't want to really do it right now is it's a very long plowing mission. And I'm not even joking, it's, it's a long one. I think it takes like 45 minutes to an hour to do it. If it's the one I'm thinking of, it might not be. So we're gonna, we'll stop by and, and see. Oh, watch out. Walking in the middle of the road. It's 
another person. It's it's pretty cool, like how you know the 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 different characters in the game all have kind of like their own schedule. Like they'll actually go inside at night, they'll come out in the daylight, and uh, yeah. Ha, oh, here we go. Yeah, There's the manure spreader. Looking, looking for, for a job. job. Actually, I could use that manure spreader over there. Mm. Interested? Know anything about construction? Repairs? Why, yes, I do. Sure. I'm quite skilled. <laughs> Good to hear. All right, uh, I'm in between travels, and these buildings need a lot of work. Fix them for me, and the spreader's yours. Oh, sounds fair. Will do. Sounds fair. Will do. So, let's see. I guess we'll start over here. Get out our repair tool, though. <clears throat> now, let's see here. I don't think it's going to... Okay. Never mind, then. I was trying to see if I had the steel sheet on me, but I don't. I have the t what looks to be the tool for it, but I don't actually have the sheet, I guess. I don't have to pick that up from the, the home lot. And I don't know how many buildings here we're going to have to fix. It might be might just be this one it might be a couple others or one other I just don't know because I would have swore this was a or this used to be a uh, plowing mission but I might have remembered wrong too so you know it's been known to happen in my old age <laughs> all right Okay. We'll be done with this one in a jiff. Okay. Well, it doesn't look new, but it sure looks better than it did, that's for sure. Okay. And again, I, I actually like holding both mouse buttons down so I get the constant engineer vision. See, we got a little bit more here. Some of the stuff, you know, you can just look at, and, you know, you know it has to be fixed. All right, fix another building. Does this have a stair going up? Yeah, it does. Okay. All right. know if we'll need a scaffolding for this. I don't see any damaged roof yet, but um, you never know. We'll get back to the backside and there it will be. Oh no. That will go inside. Maybe we can reach it from there. And yep, no 
No roof segments, which is good. At least not yet. Can I get up here? Oh, nice. I still can't read. Okay. Um. Yeah, I think I'm going to definitely need a scaffolding on the outside. This we might. Yay! Well, we'll only have to build up one scaffolding, so that's not not too bad. Okay. Actually, let's just go out here. the last building. Alright, so we had three total here. <clears throat> this one, uh, I don't know if I can... Oh, this one will have a roof. Okay. This is a little bit like our barn at home, or it might be exactly the same. No, it looks pretty much the same. With as run down as this area is, I almost half convinced that like this place was hit by a tornado or an earthquake or something. These will have to build a scaffolding to get up on the roof. to fix the roof all right I'm not gonna complain is this I think this is like a milk milkery milkery yeah just uh see he's got like big segments of uh, barn missing there too I can only imagine that he basically has allowed me to finish because we're not to the point yet where we have the metal roofing stuff, I guess. I don't know. Sure. Thanks. All right. So now the uh, manure trailer is ours. Or the manure spreader, excusez-moi. And no more jobs, but we can do the job for the um, for 
for the uh, fertilizer. I think it's fairly simple, but it requires a bit of travel. Um, you can also see the dashboard is back to normal. Uh, if you saw the last episode and saw how it kind of looked like a rock formation. Um, they haven't patched it yet. It's just like sometimes it looks like that, sometimes it doesn't. Um, I don't really know, you know, what the issue with it is. Somebody's standing out in front of the house down there. Look at these big fields. Shy Lydia, that lady over there ha seems to have an old fertilizer. Why, oh, yes, yes, she does. Hello. Hello, handsome. I am Lydia. Nice to see you. Hello. Hello, Lydia. Just wondering if you need any help. I'm looking for work. Well, since you ask, yes, I need help, but I'm afraid you can't do it. Just tell me. I can do a lot. Farming, rebuilding, you name it. So sweet of you, but my problems are of very different nature. Ooh. You know, there is a man, and well, him, I mean, I... Come on now, you can tell me. <laughs> wow, he's so charming and handsome, and Ugh. so lovely. I would love to ask him to dance on Saturday night, but I'm so ashamed to do it myself. In fact, I'm even scared to talk to him, though I would love to so much. Whoa. I think I can talk to him, but I don't work for free. Anything, sweetie, anything. What would you like? I want your fertilizer. I could use some equipment. Is this fertilizer here available? If you help me, I won't need it anyway. I mean, if you do help me. She doesn't have, like, that shy girl voice. His name is Will. William. He lives down by the road. Beautiful house. You won't miss it. I'm on my way. All right. All right, so where is William? Okay, okay, so he's... Oh, my gosh. He's way down there. All right. <clears throat> Will? I think I can go this way. And we'll speed on down there and uh, we'll see you at William's place. Okay, so uh, we're down here and William should be in the vicinity. Wait, did I pass him? Oh no, I passed him. That's what I get for not putting like a waypoint, ah, a waypoint marker on the map. <laughs> Whoops. But that's all right. We didn't really, you know, we only went 500 meters out of the way, you know. <laughs> it's all good. Uh, since they've added this new pickup truck, even though it looks like a beater, um, it does make getting around the field much, much quicker. So I cannot, I cannot thank Toplets enough for uh, for making sure they added uh, this in. All right. Hello, can I help you? Yes, there's a chick that well, wants to I was just driving by anyway Speaking of which do you know a lady <laughs> named Lydia up the road well who doesn't she's quite a beauty but shy I've been trying to talk to her and she seems to avoid me pity oh women listen it is perhaps none of my business it is perhaps what the heck is delighted if you asked her for a dance this Saturday you say but I was thinking this has to be some That's of the worst understand. voice acting I've ever heard. All right. This sounds great. What the heck? I will. Good luck. See you around. Sure. Thanks. You're welcome. 
Don't forget to bring protect. Wait, no, that's wrong. All right, let's get back up to Lydia. So <laughs> another time lapse, and hopefully we'll uh, we won't drive past her this time. Alright, so we are back at Lydia's place, and let's give her the good news. I am so happy. I can't think about anything but William. Whoa. What about your buddy that's helping you out? Um, I guess I'm super hungry. Congratulations, you've earned the fertilizer. Let's go ahead and eat some eggs here. We'll eat our last apple. Um, now the sun is kind of getting ready to go down and I would like to kind of close the episode out um, where back. Oh, I received five social points. Um, I would like to cl close the episode out on the bonfire. So um, I'm going to drive back and we're going to pick up the tractor and we're going to pick up our two new pieces of equipment. But I'm going to time lapse it. <laughs> you guessed it. Lots of time lapses. But we got a lot done. And we only have, I think, just the one piece of equipment left to get after this, which is the sower or the seeder. And so, uh, yeah, we'll probably do that in the next episode. So sit back, enjoy the time lapse, and we'll see you when we're done. So one last thing that, um, whoa, <laughs> the bird there. One last thing that I wanted to do before we closed out this episode was run down and we want to buy um, another cow. Well, I think our first cow. Yeah, we don't have any owned. And we have 513 euros. So there's one. Uh, we shouldn't need any uh, hay. Uh, I believe we already have hay available. And then let's just go ahead and buy another chicken just for fun. Because we're going to get the, uh, the benefits of those um, in the morning. We'll have uh, some extra milk, which we could either keep or sell. And we can actually teleport back to the farm now. Uh, but yeah, we'll have those in the morning when we get up. <clears throat> and we come in here and we can see our cow. As he apparently or she lays down to go to sleep. Yeah. Should <clears throat> I should close the uh, doors over here. Um, and yeah, here's our magazine. Wait a second. Does it not? Oh, wait. Oh, here we go. Hay stored 1,000 kilograms. And we'll... we'll basically fill that up um, as soon as we uh, start harvesting the straw. So it is nighttime and I promised you guys I would come over here and light the fire. There we go. So we get, got a nice glow and we can unfortunately, I don't, can I sit down? Can I squat? I thought there was a squat key, but I guess not. 
So there you have it, guys. There is the fire, and uh, we got a lot. We got tons done. We got two new pieces of equipment: the manure spreader and the fertilizer spreader. Um, by doing the different missions, we took a look at all of the uh, vehicle shops. Uh, we got our first cow and extra chicken, and we're just kind of going to kick back here and enjoy the fire. Well, guys, thank you so much for watching yet another episode of Farmer's Dynasty. If you'd like more information on the game, the link to Steam is down in the video description. Um, leave a comment. Let me know what you think of the game. Let me know how I am doing. And if you haven't done so, please subscribe for this and many more videos. And do not forget to hit the little bell next to the subscribe button so that you'll get notifications on when all of my new videos go live. Well, guys, that is it for me. I am Bradham73, and I will see you next time. Good night, and bye for now.